This is Peak Oil News. I'm your host, Mr. Andrew Zara. We're covering Peak Oil, renewable energy, electric cars, and everything in between. Tesla continues to dominate the EV headlines, with consumer reports saying it's the best car they've ever tested. Some politicians have called Tesla an outright loser, probably because it doesn't use oil as its main fuel source, and they took a loan from the government, which they now plan on paying back years earlier. They also had their first quarterly profit in history, which helped their stock price recently soar. One drawback of the Tesla review was that you have to plug it in every couple hundred miles. The transition flying car inches closer to production. This two-seat roadworthy aircraft has had delays. Its unusual design allows you to drive it like a car, fill it up with unleaded gas, and park it in your garage. My concern is, since it is an aircraft, small fender benders on the road might end up grounding the plane and costing you a lot in repairs. China is building the world's tallest building called Sky City. It'll be a prefab building that will be erected on site in 90 days. It'll be about 30 feet taller than the Berg skyscraper in Dubai. A person could live their entire life in Sky City, which is over a half a mile tall. There will be a school, a hospital, office space, and a million square feet of organic vertical farms. Sky City will house about 30,000 people, and supposedly it can handle a 9.0 earthquake. That's it for this week's edition of Peak Oil News. Please subscribe to my channel, like and share this video, and go to MrAndrewZar.com. Thank you.